They help scare some of Scarborough's seagulls away and stop them swooping in to steal food from your hands. It's one of the ideas being looked at to tackle the town's growing population of gulls. Yep, today the council's been debating whether to bring in a firm to remove some of the nests and to use a hawk to move the gulls elsewhere. Emma Glasby has been there. Seagulls and Scarborough just go together. But in recent years, the relationship has been turning slightly sour. The number of birds in this town has grown to a few thousand. And especially in the summer, it's claimed they're becoming more aggressive. I've seen them actually take food out of people's hands and things like that. But it's children, it can be quite scary, can't it? People are feeding them as well. They're feeding them the tidbits and the things. I should not encourage them to come to the area. I don't think this is a real issue. I think one or two people complain too, too much about the back of the I have seen uh, them swoop down and take uh, food out of the child's hand. But um, as I said, I don't think it's all of the girls. Today, the council's been discussing what to do about the girls. Councillors could decide to 